In this video, I'm going to show you the big nickel over G defense that I have been using, at least a piece of it. That's kind of a preview. I just did a massive, and I mean massive update in our Patreon membership, teaching a really, really breakthrough concept with the big nickel over G. It's not what you probably are thinking it is. It's actually something that's really powerful that you can do that um, I don't know that really anyone has talked about this year from Big Nickel over G that makes it the best defense in the game, the most versatile defense in the game, and in my opinion, the best defense in the game. So if you want to check that out, that'll be linked in the description. Um, you can get those kind of, you can get all my eBooks. I got a whole Big Nickel over G eBook. Um, you can get all the updates to that by joining my membership. It's only 10 bucks to sign up for that. And it does get you access to all of my Madden 22 offensive and defensive guides and all the updates to those guides and all the weekly updates that we do just to kind of, um, as new concepts come, you know, available. Okay, guys, so this is my favorite defense right now. And what we're going to do is we're going to turn auto flip off. We're going to put our auto alignment to base and we're going to put our option defense on conservative. Now, the audibles that I like to set for this defense, which um, you know you can do this if you want to. It's not really, like you can do whatever audibles you want, to be honest. I like the LB Blitz as kind of one of my key audibles, uh, just because it keeps the right players, quote unquote, in man coverage for how we're gonna run this. And then I love my match coverages. So cover four palms. Um, and really I kind of stick with the cover four. So cover four palms, cover four quarters, and if you want to, you can run a cover six or cover nine. I personally don't run those. Um, you could also use cover three match. And the reason I don't run those is primarily for what I'm about to show you. You could also put pinch blitz in here, that's fine. Um, or Mike Strong safety three. Really this last one is kind of whatever you want to put in your arsenal. I probably, generally speaking, will put Mike SS three in here. And then um, you see here that from like a adjustments perspective, I like to come out in the standard big nickel over G and we're just going to come out and run a lot of cover two, to be honest. Um, cover two from this is really, 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 really good. Now you could run SS blitz two if you want to, um, because you'll get two vertical hooks from your linebackers. You could run cover two contain if you want to, you could run cover two, whatever you guys want to do. I tend to run the cover two, um, just the standard cover two, but you can do, you know, you can do whatever you want. And it's real straightforward how we're gonna set this up. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna show blitz and we're actually gonna use our, this uh, defender here, Savage. So we're gonna show blitz and we're gonna pinch our defensive line. And then what I like to do is in instantly put my safety on the left side who's down in the box. If you pull up his adjustments, you see these hidden adjustments that Big Nickel has where you can put him in outside third. So I'm gonna put him in an outside third and then the really important thing here is I'm going to be able to put my slot corner in an outside third. So you can see right there on that side, I'm going to put my slot corner and outside third on the bunch side. He's going to do a really good job at guarding corner routes, really good job at guarding, you know, anything to the right. And then um, I'm going to put my uh, linebacker in the middle here into a middle third. And then really important here, you see how I have this vert hook on the left. Now, you can do a couple different things with this defense. It's honestly as is to you. You could, um, I'll give you an example. You could send some pressure. So if you want to try to blitz him like this, you could. Um, I like to man him up on the tight end or cross man, essentially the tight end. And then we're going to drop, um, I'm going to crash my line out, blitz my user. And then on the left side here, what we're going to do is we're just going to drop our defensive end on the right side and a vert hook. And we're going to drop our defensive end on the left side into a three wreck. And we're just going to dress two simple pressure, really good pressure in my opinion. And what you'll see is against verticals, um, the cross man on the tight end will be really good for the verticals route. And then this three wreck combined with our user will really do a good job here. And then you'll see we'll be able to get back. Now the other thing that I really like is notice that that outside third does such an incredible, incredible job at guarding that player right there. Now, if you don't want to run it this way, that's fine. I'm going to give you an additional way that you can run this um, that's a little bit better for Bunch in particularly. So the way that you can kind of run it secretly is we're going to shade coverage down, show blitz. We're going to put both 
of our guys on the outside in clouds and then really really important we're gonna bring this guy down right here and we're gonna click off of him and put him in a outside third to the right side so you see there outside third we got an outside third to the left we're gonna use her Davis over the kind of where we were using the safety and then we got a middle third coming from the left side now the only reason why you might want to do this is because now you're gonna have really good uh, coverage from this vertical hook and what I like to do is hard flat my defensive end or if you wanted to you could man him up on the tight end as well and then bluff blitz on the left side of the screen with the defensive end so we're still rushing to it's a simple coverage defense my favorite coverage defense in the game and what you'll see here is just really good coverage and you get crazy crazy sheds now this is not all by any means that you can do so what you can do out of this um, another thing that you can do is you can bring this guy down now when I bring him down what I'm gonna do is just for the situation here we're actually gonna send some pressure so what I like to do when I send pressure is I really like to have this vertical hook over here combined with a cloud flat and the reason why is because those are gonna play wheel routes really well flat routes really well so what I like to do is shade down put the cloud flat out here for Alexander and then when we're gonna bring this guy down we're gonna put him into an outside third we're gonna then take our linebacker on the left side and put him in a middle third. And then really, really important, we're gonna man up the solo receiver with that corner. And then now we're gonna blitz that safety that we were putting in coverage. And if the running back goes on a route, um, we're gonna go guard him. If the running back does not go on a route, then what I tend to like to do um, is just work to the solo receiver. Normally the running back will go on a route, especially if you've been establishing that you're gonna be in coverage defense. So verticals, they're gonna run their wheel. And what you'll see is you just get this crazy edge pressure. And as you can see, the coverage really does a nice little job. So that's a way that you can mix max coverage and um, also mixing in pressure into one defense. And that's what's beautiful about Big Nickel over G. Now, if you want to get the full defense, I have to stress this in this video. The defense is absolutely incredible. It's my best defense I've ever put together. And um, there's literally right now, it's just in the, um, if, if you join the membership right now, you'll get instant access to everything. And again, you're gonna get access to some of the updates that we're gonna do over the course of the next couple of weeks because we did just find some stuff out of this formation that's really, really good that we updated today in our membership. But if you wanna get everything, like I said, just join the membership. There's a link in the description if you wanna check it out. And I'm just telling you right now, Big Nickel Over G is so much better than people realize. And there's so much more that you can do with it than meets the eye. Thanks for watching the video. And if you wanna get the full defensive ebook, it is in my Patreon down in the description.